Wasif is um, beautiful, especially at night. You're right near the ocean and you can kind of see the, the water glistening with the lights over here. Um, it has many suit, like little restaurants and stores. Like it even has pets with fish and all kinds of animals. Like I think it might have like chickens and stuff too. And then, but they're all inside the soup. You have to go inside. And then you can actually get gold here and linens here. Actually, anything you really need is kind of here. But on the outside by the water, it's mostly restaurants. Because people come in normal, normal times and they sit here outside. You see the patios. And they sit in the patio and look over the water. And this is the ocean. So you can swim in the ocean, but not now, not too now in COVID times, I would swim here and we would walk around here and every day I kind of walk around here so the security kind of know me. Um, Thank you. Yeah. So it's, it's almost empty because of the restriction. But they're also building over there during the day. They're building something on the shore. I asked the other day and they were building something and the security <coughs> doesn't know what they're building but they're building something like maybe another platform for the boats or here you can get any kind of food ice cream italian arabic this is yemeni food so dining is not allowed and you can get carrots. it used to be full you can get this place used to be packed at night but also it's not a weekend so maybe on the weekends but it's also COVID, so people can't bring their kids so that stops a lot. Yeah. Usually, and also because it's Ramadan, they're fasting during the day till seven, seven, seven ish. So by nighttime, they're tired again. Or they're eating with their families. Usually, too, you can see kittens. We've seen kittens here in the spring. A mother cat with their little kittens running around, the security feed them. Yeah. It's beautiful. And you can see a boat here. And there's also a hotel here. Sukhwafi Hotel in here. Yeah, Sukhalokra Hotel. Great breakfasts. And you can get discounts if you're a teacher. <laughs> they used to have where you go in the morning and. They used to have buffet, shisha. But now, because of COVID, you just can order the food you want. You can't yes. go to a buffet. It's still good though. We should do that. They don't have them right now. Once it opens after we weekend. The nice thing about the Suku is there's lots to see and lots to do. So as you're walking through, it used you to get, be full, yeah. You get good exercise, but at the same time, you're seeing some beautiful water. You're feeling the breeze from the water, even though it feels hot. You have kind of a bit of a breeze. And you're seeing a lot of different people. Assalamu alaikum. So here's a boat that they So have. that's a rest, uh, coffee, uh, cafe. Cafe. So they are building something there. Layali Halmeya restaurant, it must be Egyptian. I know the name. So they are doing something here. I think for the Eid, right? Eid al Fatr. Hi. Wow, yes. For Eid al Fatr. Oh, that looks good. You see, there's both dots. 
You can take the boats out. But now they're docked for a while. They're a beach. You know, it's not even in the water. And it's sad. So now they're more for decoration. And in springtime, you can April, you can find little crabs in the water on the rocks. Yeah. Ah, there are more boats here. I think it's only in certain times of the year. But the tiny little crabs, they're so cute, cute. Tiger cookies are super yummy. Super fighting with super yummy. And super expensive. Where? Right oh, is it an Italian one? It's Italian. We should try one there. Mercato Atletico, no? Yeah, it's Italian. Antico, yeah. We should get it's Italian. Italian one there. Yeah, there are lots of coffee shops, but unfortunately now we cannot sit in the coffee shops. Yeah, we can't 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 sit in the